What up? I'm Chef Apelka. This is the Braves Time of Vlog. So it's been a week and a lot has happened. First of all, the Braves are better without Freddie Freeman than they are with him, but that's not what I want to talk about. What I want to talk about is what just happened, which is that Bryce Harper caught a 98 mile an hour fastball to the pelvis, and I could hear it. I could hear it go like, at, I'm so, that. That's what it sounded like. It, I could. Just, and so Bryce went in and, and had just had to throw fades to him. He, and I, I watched it. The clip that I watched was the Nationals uh, announcers who, like, the second he got hit, the announcer goes like, uh, there's a history. And the other is just like, well, you got to do it. You got to throw hands. You have to. Uh, and so much just went on. First of all, Bryce went in with the helmet and he threw it to right field. Uh, I don't, I don't know. Uh, and then, then Bryce got a good look on Strickland, and then Strickland got one on Harper, and then Harper fell backwards a little bit, and then the entire Giants bench collapsed onto Hunter Strickland like, no! Uh, and they, th I think they saved him, because someone was gonna win that fight if it kept on going for a minute, and it was gonna be Bryce Harper. You can take his pelvis, but you can never take his pride. Meanwhile, Buster Posey was like, yeah, you know, I think Buster Posey was like sitting behind home plate and he like heard it do this and he was like, oh, I would beat his ass. And then, I don't know if any of you noticed, like the umpire went out to look at, the, the umpire went out like the catcher's supposed to do, but then he just watched it like a referee because he could either get in the middle of it and he'll catch a fade or he can grab a player and then they'll catch six so he was like, you know what, I'm gonna let everyone else handle this. The sad part is Buster Posey didn't fight because he was trying to communicate with the Nationals like, yo, I don't want this, don't hit me tomorrow. If I were Buster Posey, I would go straight up to Bruce Bochy today and be like, yo, I'm gonna take a day tomorrow. You can catch me at the golf course, I'll take the suspension. There's plenty else to talk about. Uh, first of all, I had that poll about who had more talent, Allard, Tookie, or Newcomb. Newcomb had one vote, Gohara had one vote. Uh, Nuka, or, uh, Tookie had nine votes and Allard had 14 votes. So everyone voted for Colby Allard, the highest talent, uh, pitcher in the Braves farm system. What else is there? Uh, I think that we've got to put a, a watch on Bartolo Colon. Here's the thing. June 9th is Bartolo Colon bobblehead night. So I think we could do like a fun thing where it's like race to bobblehead night. Who's going to get here first, bobblehead night or the cutting of Bartolo Colon. I don't know. You know, it's like 12 days away. So we'll see. Uh, I'm rooting for just cut him. Who cares? Uh, he's 44. He sucks. I don't think it's coming together. I could be wrong. You know, that's another thing. Everything that I've said on this channel lately has been wrong. Uh, like I was saying that like, oh, the season's over because we lost Freeman. I everyone was saying that. And then like Matt Adams shows up and then the Braves win like, I, like, the rest of their games that week. So, I mean, I'm just not going to jinx stuff, I guess. So I'm not going to talk about Dansby Swanson actually getting a good amount of walks lately. I'm not going to talk about it. I'm not going to talk about Lucas Sims being dominant at AAA. I'm not going to discuss it. I'm not going to talk about Jaime Garcia actually being really good. He's been really, really good, but that's not, you didn't hear it from me. These aren't the things that I'm saying. I'm not going to denote that I'm really impressed with Brian Snicker for like getting them all together and like the season was lost and then, then it was found. I'm not going to say those things. Those won't come out of my mouth because when I say good things, the opposite of them happens. So I'm just going to say bad things. Uh, and we'll see, you know, who's to say. I think that Freddie Freeman's wrist won't heal tomorrow. I think that we won't trade Jim Johnson for Glabar Torres. I think that SunTrust Park won't offer me a lifetime of free food and beverages. I think that the Nationals' rotation won't fall apart tomorrow. I don't know, this is a weird episode. I didn't actually put any facts in it. I just sat in front of the camera and just said all of the emotions that came to my mind. I hope I made a good video out of it. Do tell in the comments. Uh, you know, you can hurt my feelings. Don't be afraid of it. Either way, this is Chef Apelka, the Braves Time Vlog YouTube channel where I talk about the Braves and baseball in general. Uh, it sounds like your cup of tea. Check out the channel, see if it's for you. I really hope you enjoyed, uh, and go Braves.